you know, that's what the ultimate goal of pressing the panda button is. I want to be able to reach out to anybody. Good morning, internet friends. How are we doing today? Oh, okay, I couldn't remember if my phone was on silent or not. Uh, I'm not doing the greatest, honestly. Um, I didn't have my Ambien last night, and I got so frustrated because I did yoga, I did meditation, and you know I was good to go to bed. Everything was great. Then the dogs woke me up for no reason, and I couldn't get back to sleep. And I kept going in like intervals of like sleep for two hours and then have to wake up and then couldn't get back to sleep for at least another hour so didn't get a whole lot of sleep last night I slept in some this morning enough but I was still able to get to class class is okay until we got our test um like it's a test that we could take home but we could work on it some during class and some and we could work on it during class on Tuesday but my anxiety went through the roof. It was like I was reading the information, but I couldn't tell what it was saying. I felt like I couldn't understand it. Um, I was getting really bad tunnel vision. I just was feeling like utter crap. So now I'm done, which is great. I've got a few errands to run. Need to go by the bank, probably get something to eat. Need to go by CVS so I could get my Ambien. Um... I don't know if this is part of it at all, but I completely forgot to take my meds last night and this morning and probably won't take them this afternoon either so I don't have them on me. And then I'll usually forget, so... <sighs> I don't know, just... I guess it's just not a good day today. <laughs> and tonight I have to meet with my project group at 6 at the library. And I'm already worried I'm going to look like an idiot in front of them. I don't know them very well. So, I'm probably going to look stupid. Not looking forward to it at all. Hey guys, so right now I am with my mom. We just went shopping at Hobby Lobby for an event she's having Saturday. Or is it tomorrow? I think it's Saturday. I don't remember now. Um, I had lunch with her and was like, I'll go to Hobby Lobby. And then just like going through the storm, I got really lightheaded, started to feel a little faint, and my heart rate was going up. Um, so I have a heart rate up on my phone. I don't think it's the most reliable, but it was something, and my heart rate was up to 101, which my average is around 83, 84. So I'm like, what is going on? So my mom had me come sit in the car, and I'm really not feeling good. I'm not thinking it's a panic attack. That's got me worried that it'd be like last night where I nearly passed out. So I have no idea what's going on. Hey guys. So, um, I will go ahead. I guess I'll first start with, I am feeling better since the last clip. Um, got home and went to my room and took a nap for about an hour. And that really helped. So I'm guessing the lightheadedness was because of lack of sleep. Since I had such a difficult time sleeping last night. But today, I picked up prescriptions. So I have me some more Ambien. Yes! Which means sleep! Um, let's see. I made dinner. I ended up making this breakfast casserole, which was pretty good. Literally, if you want to know how to make it, get like a baking dish or like a Pyrex thing, whatever. Put in frozen hash browns, eggs, cheese, and ham cubes, or slice, chopped up ham, whatever. However much you want. $3.50 for an hour. Done. Yum. So, I had a bacon in the oven, and then I had to go to... I was meeting with my project group from class. We met back at the college to work on some of the questions for the presentation. And after about an hour and a half, we came back. I came home and ate dinner. And now I'm about to get me a shower before I work on the vlog and go to the comment section. Which I love going to the comment section. 
And guys, we have 123 of us now. So yay! The Press in the Painted Button family is growing and I'm so happy because it means that more people are getting reached out to. And that's what I, you know, that's what the ultimate goal of pressing the panda button is. I want to be able to reach out to anybody. Like, if you have a mental illness, it doesn't even have to be anxiety. Be whatever mental illness. I want to be able to reach out to you so that, you know, you don't feel alone. Because we all know that mental illnesses will make you feel very isolated. And if you don't have a mental illness, I want to show the, you know, this is what life is like with a mental illness for somebody. You know, this is not the stigma where we are locked in a nut house or something. So, I'm so glad that we're reaching out to people. Yay! It makes me very happy. So, um, I guess I'll do a really quick introduction for anybody who's new. Hi, my name is Raven. I'm 22. I will be 23 in May. Um... I have generalized anxiety disorder, major depressive disorder, and panic disorder. Yeah. And I vlog every day about what it's like living with all three. So, um, I'm also training a service dog. He is a Weimariner. His name is Emeril. He will be six months old on the 24th. And he is my world. Um, you probably have seen him by now in my vlogs because I always show all three of my dogs. Yes, he is my first service dog. Because I did have somebody ask me if he was my only dog that was a service dog since I have Sassy and Riddler. Yes, he is my first. Um, and yeah. So, there you go. There's a really quick introduction for you. So now I'm going to go and get me a shower and I'll check back in with you guys later. Hey guys. There's Riddler. There the Sassers. Where's her head? There it is. And there be the Amaral. Make sure the camera's actually pointed at him this time. Look, it is! Emeril! Fluff butt! Hi, sweetie! Say, I'm tired, mommy! So, I got the vlog up. I got all the comments responded to. Yay! I love that you guys are commenting. That is awesome. I love interacting with you guys. But, I'm gonna give you one little idea. You can also try interacting with each other. So we can all get to know each other in the Pressing the Panda Button family, because I know a lot of you guys. But, talk to each other. It's a great time. Um, what else? I, I had a thought. Uh, I hate it when the thoughts come and then they're like, nope, gonna go away. And I'm just like, dang it. So I got meds taken, contacts out, lotion on my face. Exciting. That's why my face looks a little bit shiny. Um, took the dogs outside to go potty. My cat's been weird. Yes, I do have a cat. She lives outside, which is why you never see her. Her name is Gypsy. She's... I have no idea how old that cat is by now. No clue. But she's a wonderful kitty. She's starting to be kind of weird and lick my toes. I'm not sure what that is about. I mean, she likes being... She'll, like, rub all over you and you can pet on her. She'll lick you sometimes. Um... What's Essie? <laughs> um, she'll let you hold her for like a couple of seconds and then she wiggles a lot to get down she doesn't like to be held for long but she's a wonderful kitty um, my dog's a goober let me point that out to you what are you doing <laughs> getting some last minute energy out before bedtime buddy you're so weird. Oh my goodness. Yep, that's a calendar back there, but it's alright. It did Riddler a big concern. Did it do you a big concern? Yeah. Are you pushing the calendar back for me? No, 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 don't push that. Oh my god. I feel like you guys are on the edge of this falling anyway. My Darth Vader poster. Captain America's behind it. Emerald, what are you doing? Popper! Hi, 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 hi. 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 Hey, sweet boy. He's like, Mom, what's back there? You know what's back there. But I mainly have those there so he can't get to the cords behind it. But at this point, you're not really at the stage of chewing on cords. I don't think. Hi. 
Are you ready for bedtime, buddy? Yeah? Is that a yes? Yeah. So, we're all ready for bed, so we're going to sign up for the night and head off to bed. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've had a wonderful day or night, rain or shine, whatever the world has for you today. Uh, question of the day is... Make up your own question of the day today. Ask me whatever you want. Or if you want to post a question for everybody else to answer. You know what? That's a great idea. We'll do that. Post a question that I have to answer and anybody else who comes through the comments should answer. So we can all get to know each other. Let's put your questions down below and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye! Good night, my little fluffer butt. Good night, my sassafras. And good night, Riddler.